Right, guys, just a quick one here, because surprise, surprise, there is not much information about this story actually forthcoming. This is common practice with these type of stories or anything of importance because someone might get offended if the truth is told. I have even given it a couple of days to see if more information has been reported about it, but at this time, limited info is all we have. Now, you all might remember back over the months and years hearing about the petition that was put into the government. This was demanding Sajid Javid's report is released in full, all while more groups of mostly Pakistan Pakistani men are being arrested up and down the country for grooming and sexual exploitation of children in the UK, with some absolute horror stories that would be out of place in third world countries let alone here. Now naturally, successive governments from both sides have failed these kids and continue to do so, but in this case we have here 21 possible groomers that could be about to face a small bit of justice. I'd say possible groomers at the moment because the information is extremely limited, but 21 being arrested for crimes against one girl says to me we have another one here. It's just a shame it's taken the police between 19 and 11 years to actually get an arrest since these crimes relate to between 2001 and 2009, which were first picked up by the Examiner Live but it seems ITV have also picked up on it and essentially copied word for word their article, so we'll take a quick look at that. But bear in mind it is very short with limited information but it's still important to get it out there so the country knows it's happening. It headlines, police in Bradford arrest 21 men over child sexual abuse allegations dating back to 2001. West Yorkshire Police have arrested 21 men as part of an investigation into child sexual abuse allegations in Bradford which are reported to have occurred between 2001 and 2009. The allegations relate to one female victim, which is exactly what makes me think this is another grooming gang situation as a matter of fact I would be willing to bet on it. It continues, the men aged between 33 and 41 were arrested from addresses in Bradford, Shipley and Keeley as part of a three week operation. All 21 men have been interviewed and released pending further inquiries. Detective Superintendent Sarah Jones of Bradford District Police said the investigation forms part of West Yorkshire Police's commitment to the investigation of both current and non-recent sexual offences against children. Tackling child abuse is not something that any one agency can do in isolation though, which is why we have worked closely with local authorities and other organisations and charities to support victims, bring offenders to justice and make our communities safer. Well, I've got to say I take issue with what you've said there because the communities certainly don't feel safer to me for much people and especially kids in this day and age. It finishes up with, we would urge anyone who has been the victim of sexual abuse, whether recent or historic, to report it to the police. Please be assured that you will be listened to, taken seriously and supported by professionals with experience of dealing with these kind of offences. Now them saying that last bit at the end there would suggest to me that they haven't taken people seriously and have instead, like we know, blamed them for what has happened to them as we have heard from various people about police forces and police police officers and what they have said to these girls. But like I said, that is literally the end of the article and that is all the information that we have at the moment. I had a good scour this morning and couldn't find anything else that was up there about it. So no doubt we'll be waiting months or years for any information on this if we ever get it. No doubt it will be much like the grooming gang report that the petition demanded was released and the government fobbed us off with. The police and the powers that be will probably fob us off on this and we won't get any information if these people get convicted. But like I said earlier, the fact this is 21 men that have been arrested for allegations against one child, I would suggest this has to be a grooming gang situation. Now obviously we've got no descriptions of the people involved, but I know where I will be placing my money. There is a pattern consistent throughout history of oppressed people turning on the oppressors. Slaves against their owners, the peasantry against the feudal barons, colonies, Mr. Verhofstadt, against their empires. And that is why Britain is leaving. And it doesn't matter which language you use, we are going and we are glad to be going. We're off. <laughs>